Have you ever really wanted to do something? I mean, you wanted to do it so bad. And God's like, no. And you're like, <clears throat> well, I'm just going to try it. And maybe it'll work out. You ever tried that? I have. And I'm telling you something. It doesn't work. In chapter 24 of Numbers, Balaam, the prophet, finds out that whatever you try to do that God doesn't want you to do is a waste of time and effort and everyone leaves angry. He wanted Balak's money. The king of Moab was going to give him money to curse Israel. And so he's like, well, I can't go. Well, can I go? And then God says, fine, go. But he tries four times and they offer 21 animals, rams and goats. And every time he tries to curse Israel, the words won't come out. He can't do it. He tries to curse Israel and everything comes out as a blessing. I got to hand it to the king Balaam or Balak. He knew that the strength of Israel was spiritual. He knew he couldn't defeat them militarily. He knew that they, he had to defeat them spiritually. We forget that as believers. We think that our strength is in our, our mind or our money or, you know, our experience. It's, it's all in Christ. It's on our, it's our walk with him, our spiritual experience. But if we're on the wrong path, it ends up so badly. They're both angry. Balaam, the prophet, all he wants is a big paycheck to curse. Well, Balak says, I'm not paying you. You wouldn't curse them. The king is angry. The prophet's angry. Everyone walks away sad. But it never should have happened. God said from the very beginning, don't go with these guys. I'm not going to let you curse Israel. What is it you're pursuing that God's already told you don't do this? How, how long do you want to go with this? How long do you want to keep fighting against God? It comes a point where you just say, okay, you know what, God? I, I get it. I will do what you want me to do. And I want to tell you something. The moment you make that decision, you won't miss it. You won't miss what you think you've given up. In fact, you gained your life. Because time is what your life is made up of. And you won't waste any more time when you get back on the right path.